So this is we're talking at a time when Governor Rajan uh, seems to have brought a sense of confidence back into the markets. What are your own expectations from the Reserve Bank of India? Well, you know, we have this picture of celebrity central bankers these days. And, you know, it's a bit like Clark Kent stepping into his little sort of booth and putting on a Superman uniform. And I think Mr. Rajan is a very, very talented individual, mm. but he faces a number of problems. The first is, is his tools. What's he got? He's basically got certain sort of tools in front of him. He can intervene in currency markets, which is a very dangerous strategy, because unless you've got, you know, several hundred billion dollars to throw around, you're not going to have much effect. He can play with interest rates, and he's done that to some degree to try to bolster the currency. But he's got to sort of now try to sort of balance those against some of the key dynamics going on. If the currency is weak, it helps the exporters, but external weak, uh, demand is weak, and he can't control that. If the currency is weak, then oil imports and the prices for that go up. He has no control over the fiscal side where the government, with the election approaching, is going to be spending like a drunken sailor in town. And so, and particularly the food bills which have come in, which frankly will not actually benefit the people who really need help and will be actually gamed as previous things like the fuel subsidies have been. And that's going to create budgetary pressures which he's going to have to try to offset. And to some extent, he can, you know, bark all he likes about structural change. But outside the financial system, I fail to see how he's going to make the changes in the political and the decision-making process. So he's got a very, very tough job ahead of him. And he's got the other problem is that everybody is now putting the weight of expectations on him because the rest of the government processes are so dysfunctional. So I think Mr. Rajan uh, will probably need all of his fellow superheroes like Captain America, you know, and all the Hulk and everybody else to help him.